Good morning, everybody. Yeah, we're here in Perry Square, uh, which is going to be the site of a lot of festivities later today. We'll have crews here throughout the day as we are preparing to be in the path of totality. Obviously quiet now, but the northwest corner of the Commonwealth is now the epicenter of the state. Unique is an understatement. I mean, we've never seen an event of this magnitude ever in our history. I mean, we've had large events in the past, but this is not only a large event, but it's all over the county. It's not just in one location. Now, the city has been preparing for this for a year and may have the most visitors it's ever had for a single event. Pittsburgh is going to be at 97% totality and you might brush off that final 3%, but Visit Erie says it's not the same as 100% totality because the sun is so bright that even with a speck of sunlight, there's still the perception of daylight. That's the reason so many folks are going to be headed to this area today. And coming up in 30 minutes, they're the latest fashion trend, but you're going to need a pair of sunglasses like this, these solar eclipse glasses. If you want to be able to view the eclipse directly, we'll talk about this in 30 minutes and also a different kind of lens you need to have protected today. Reporting live in Erie, Tom Garris, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.